Hi, I'm Ryan Newman from Disney Zeke and Luther, and you're watching Clever TV. Hey guys, welcome back to the Clever TV Lounge. I'm Jocelyn Davis with Dana Ward. What's up? And today we are very excited to have joining us one of your favorite Disney stars, Ryan Newman. Hey. Zeke Hi, and Luther. Yes. We have, uh, we're so excited to have you here, hear about the show. I don't think we've had anybody from the show. We haven't, you are the first. Cool. And the show's been around for a while. Yeah, we're on our third season, so. So tell wow. us about your character for the one person out there who probably hasn't seen the show. <laughs> <laughs> well, um, I play Ginger, Zeke's younger sister. And Ginger is so smart. She's very um, clever and conniving, I guess you could say. She's the best at whatever she does, so she's a total perfectionist. And um, she loves to outwit and outsmart her brother. Hmm. Which I bet it's really fun working with your cast. What sorts of stuff like goes on behind the scenes when you guys aren't working? Just a lot of laughing. I have a great time with the cast. The boys are amazing. So, Have you guys gone anywhere really cool to shoot on location at all throughout the three seasons? We go a lot of places. We're most of the time on location. So um, we've gone, most of the time we're actually like outside our studio. So they make it like different sets and stuff, so it's oh, really cool. cool. We go into the neighborhoods. Um, yeah, so a lot of different places. The pier. Which pier? Uh, Santa Monica maybe or something? No, I we are in or? the uh, Redondo Beach Pier. Oh, yeah. okay. good stuff. Cool. So Very we're in that nice. neighborhood. So I bet it's really fun playing Ginger. What would you say is your favorite aspect of your character? Well, she plays a lot of pranks, and um, that's really fun for me to do because I am not a prank player, I guess you could say. <laughs> like, I'm not good at sneaking around or anything. Like, if we're trying to sneak around our parents or something, like when we were younger, I'd always laugh. I'd be the first to laugh. <laughs> Get caught. So it's really fun because, you know, you get to do that stuff, and it's all mapped out for you, you know. Mm -hmm. It's always going to go perfect, so. Yeah, what's the best prank that you've played on set? There have been a lot of pranks. Ginger, some on, of course. Some on yes. me, actually. I get really? a lot of the pranks, yes. A lot of the pranks. Like, she puts fish, like, some fish in um, Zeke's pillow. She, um, he opens his closet and a bunch of balls fall out and clothes and stuff. Like, she has some crazy stuff, but Ginger also gets a lot of it, too. Oh my gosh. Because they fight back and forth. Do you ever go to the writers and say, like, hey, I had this really great idea for for a plot line or Not normally, or I haven't. I mean, they've never asked. They always come up with amazing ideas. But we'll, we'll just talk and we'll be like, oh yeah, that'd be so fun or something like that. Now let's talk, we're obviously all girls here and lots of girls watching, about wardrobe. Oh um, my gosh, she has the cutest wardrobe. Yeah, tell us about it. So at first she used to be a little preppy. She's always on the like preppier side, but um, this season, you know, she's definitely a lot more stylish and um, like she's wearing some combat boots and stuff. A lot of Love cute it. jewelry. Ooh, yeah. yeah. Now bring us back to day one on the set. What were what was the vibe? What did it feel like? On the pilot or season one? Ooh, yeah. let's go back to the let's pilot. Go to the pilot. Let's go there. Definitely. The pilot. That was so much fun. I was like nine, so I was super oh young. Oh my gosh. Yeah, it was really exciting for me. I mean, it was a really long process to get the role, so just being on set was great. It was like really surreal. And then when it got picked up, it was amazing. Just crazy. How has your life changed, you think? Um, like a ton, completely. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I'm homeschooled now and um, just so busy. I feel like I've seen you at so many of these ho young Hollywood events and stuff. You're pretty much everywhere. Would you say a lot of your friends are now fellow actors and musicians yeah. and everything? I still have my group of friends from school. Mm -hmm. So um, I hang out with them like this Halloween. I'll go trick or treating with them. But I do have a lot of industry friends. Well, because you have a lot in common. So you guys yeah. can like, you know, see what other people are going through and you're able to talk about it. I would yeah. Guess. Mm -hmm. But it's always really important to still have your friends from yeah. like school, you know, the ones that live next door or stuff, you know. Exactly, exactly. So looking forward in Zeke and Luther, where do you think the show's gonna go? It's and, just... And where is Ginger gonna go? Yes. And Ginger's just growing up, you know. She has um, a lot of cool storylines. Um, yeah, and it's just gonna get funnier and funnier. Funny, we like Tell us funny. a little bit, like where is the storyline gonna go? A little bit. She has some stuff <laughs> at school. Oh, okay. We'll be able to see some of that, so yeah. And the boys are getting older, so the boys are like driving in the show now too. So it's really cool. Very interesting, something to look forward to. Now tell the person watching at home why they should be watching if they're not. 
Last question. You should keep watching because if you like to laugh, then you will love the show. I'm sold. Thank love you so it. much. <laughs> Ryan Newman, thank you for coming in and talking to us about Zeke and Luther. And we'll see you guys next time from the Clever TV Lounge. I'm Jocelyn Davis with Dana Ward. Have a great day. See ya. Bye.